Hey y'all, what's Dan with Dan Smoking Treasures? I've not done a video in a while, uh, but I need to make dinner anyway. So what we have here is some sliced up sirloin. And I'm gonna make some sirloin rolls. Um, it was a, it was like this tall before. I don't know, can you see that? It was like, I don't know, five inches thick. I slice them off. I'm gonna cook that steak too and have that tomorrow as leftovers. But um, what we got here, I'm gonna roll this in here with a piece of provolone. And it's gonna look something like that, but you know, ideally you would have a little bit wider roll here, but this is what I got, and I even beat it down with one of those uh tenderizer hammers. So what I have here is something my girlfriend concocted up, which is uh garlic, onion, and green pepper. And you could put mushroom and all that in there, but since these rolls are so small, I don't want to overdo it because it already squishes out. Um, if you wrap them a little bit looser, you'll be able to get more in there. If you really tie it, it squeezes out. So anyway, I already did one of these. You get the idea. You put your own mix in, whatever you like to do. Definitely beat it with the hammer because you want to try to get it thin as possible because it's not always easy to, unless you have a slicer to cut it with a knife. Um, and we'll get this on the grill and be back soon. Bye. All right, guys, we got the uh, steaks on the Weber kettle here. It's you know, it's basically 120 here today in St. Louis. It sucks. Uh, that said, um, I'm going to get a sear on this, sear on these, and then slow cook them until they're the right temperature, and we should be good to go. All right, take care. Alright guys, here we go. This is what's going on here. Sorry about the delay on the start there. I'll edit that out maybe. I don't know. We'll see. Um, what I'm waiting for is just to get these things done. Of course, all the cheese is melting out. That's why I think if you had a bigger one, it would be better. But for our purpose, this will work just fine. And yes, I'm not good at holding camera and multitasking. That's the backup plan. All right, so next time I take, uh, I start this video, it'll be when I cut one of these things open and see what they look like. Get back in there. Get back in there. All right, guys. We got this back off the grill. This is actually the first time I did this like this and uh, it's an experiment. We'll give it a try. Let's see what this looks like. Mm. Looks good. And I'm sure it tastes good, but uh, I'm not eating it right this minute. We got a couple of our sides that are almost done. Anyway, cheers to you guys. Later.